How much different is the experience this year compared to last year, particularly, you know, getting preseason games this year, which we didn't have the year? Yeah, yeah, definitely. It's a lot different. Um, just to be able to go against someone else, um, someone that doesn't necessarily like you, is a, is a big thing. And it, it's nice because last year you had to go straight into a real game and going against a real team. And it's different being able to practice that, you know? When you show up and, and, and everything's going super fast, the first uh, preseason game or the first real game last year, it's um, bullets are flying and you're kind of just thrown into the mix, whereas this year you kind of get to ease your way into it. Just confidence-wise, coming off you know, a successful rookie season, how much more confidence did you feel or do you feel right now coming in here following last year? Yeah, no, I'm definitely a lot more comfortable this year. Um, last year, it was stressful to say the least um, coming in. Uh, there's a lot of Americans fighting for a couple spots. And this year, um, be, basically being able to build off that first season and talking to Maxi and having the confidence from him, um, from him trusting me has been good and, and it's been exciting. You know, now I get to focus more so on my play than um, trying to be perfect, you know. You got a new coaching staff here. Obviously, Chris Jones has taken over. Has uh, you know, how much have things changed from a defensive standpoint in terms of schemes, that sort of thing, or has it? Yeah, no, it absolutely has changed. Um, being in the CFL, you hear a lot of things about Chris Jones and his defense, and and you don't realize how intense it is um, until obviously you get in the mix. And I'm not saying that it's that complicated per se. It's more so just tricking the offense. And he has a great defensive mind. It's been nice to play for him, and I think we're gonna get a lot of sacks this year. Uh, just last one for me, and then, you know, having the experience last year, was there anything or a couple things that you really focused on in the offseason on improving based on the experience you had in this league last year? Yeah, definitely. Um, last year being my first year playing defensive end, um, I basically had to, to try out a lot of different moves, pass rush moves, and I knew I kind of found a basis for what worked last year, whereas this year I can just build off that basis and be a lot more comfortable um, using different moves, um, getting off the ball and, and now I'm a lot more used to the yard off and it's just been uh, I've been able to get a lot more comfortable with this whole year um, a year in you know just one from me and that is uh, having Demetrius Maxey back on the coaching staff when there wasn't a lot of carryover from last year's staff to this year what does that mean for you on the defensive line in terms of your comfortability this year yeah absolutely um, with a new head coach GM you don't know how they're gonna how they're going to like you, but being able to talk to Maxi throughout the offseason and um, saying good things, you know, being able to, to rely on his viewpoint of what he's saying about um, what the new coaching staff thinks of me and stuff like that. And also, Maxi's a great guy. Everyone loves him. Um, I love to play for him. He's a great def defensive line coach, and it's been great to play for him. Thank you. Thank you.